What's up, y'all? Got another video. Uh, this one, satellite communication. I'm doing this solo. So this isn't really a glitch. This is more. I'm gonna show you the correct way to drive the trailer to Trevor's gas station. So bear with me. Got to kill some guys first. Yeah, just like everybody else. Every now and then you get waxed. Oh my god! But with proper use of cover and snacks, you can avoid death. this trailer. And I apologize I had to lower the video quality to get enough length. Ran out of room on the camera. Anyway, so here we go. And this part is crucial. You gotta follow the exact same path or risk crashing into a damn tree. Right here. Go down. And the trailer will roll with the truck as long as you don't jackknife the truck. In case the truck flips on its side, as long as the trailer is attached, you can roll it back up. Hop over right here. Oh, this way. And from here you can branch off and go whichever way is easiest for you. I tend to go this way a little quicker, more pavement in some spots. So the truck is horrifically slow when you're driving in the dirt. Go up these hills to the left of them houses. Uh, when you come up to this corner, watch out for the guardrails. Hiding behind them bushes. And watch out right here because you got hills on both sides. And they got awkward bumps right here. And it's just as you're going, you gotta watch out for rocks or hitting small hills the wrong way. Make sure you don't jackknife the trailer. And then as you can see this way, is a couple minutes quicker. And if you actually took the road from the Vinewood sign spot, 
and actually took the road around and over and then ah, it's a much longer route that way. You know, take a little risk, get a little reward. So I can do that shit a little quicker. <laughs> the only thing is now it'll pay less than it used to for doing it quicker. There you have it. The quickest route to get that truck down there to that gas station. <laughs>